नाइन लाइट एंड शेडो व्हाट आई शैल लर्न सोर्सेस ऑफ लाइट लेम्यूनस एंड नॉन लेम्यूनस ऑब्जेक्ट्स प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ लाइट ट्रांसपेरेंट ट्रांसलूसेंट एंड ओपैक मैटेरियल शेडो वार्म अप एक्टिविटी मैच द ऑब्जेक्ट इन कलम ए विथ देयर शेडोज इन कलम बी कलम ए कलम बी लाइट हेल्प अस टू सी थिंग्स लेट अस लर्न मोर अबाउट लाइट डू यू नो द मून which gives us light at night has no light of its own it shines by the light of the sun sources of light objects that gives us light are called sources of light the sun gives us light during the day it helps us to see everything around us the sun is a natural source of light stars are also natural sources of light but we do not get their light because they are far away from us sun a natural source of light other sources of light are bulbs candles and lanterns these are artificial sources of light bulb candle lantern artificial sources of light odor firefly gives out light as it has special organs in its body that produce light lemuminous and non lemuminous objects light helps us to see things around us the sun is the main source of light on earth during the day light bulb torch candle lantern and dia are some sources of light objects that give out light are called lemuminous objects for example bulb candle objects that do not give out light are called non lemuminous object for example book desk we can see non lemuminous objects only when light falls on them lemuminous objects sun bulb candle non lemuminous objects table ball older have you seen lightning flash across the sky during a thunderstorm or watched fireworks they also give out light properties of light light always travel in a straight line if anything comes in its way it bounces off from the surface of the object this is called reflection of light when you look out of the window you see many things like trees buildings and birds these are not sources of light then how do you see them we can see any object only when light falls on it and bounces off that is the light is reflected back into our eyes this is why we cannot see anything in a dark room because there is no light revision zone name the following one two natural sources of light comment this 
two two artificial sources of light come in this three two luminous objects come in this four two non luminous objects come in this get set go take three cardboards and create a hole at the center of each cardboard place this one before the other in straight line in front of a lamp or burning candle look through the holes in the cardboard in such a way that you can see the lamp or candle slightly move one of the cardboards can you see the lamp or candle now you cannot this proves that light travels in a straight line order light is important for plants too without sunlight they will not be able to make food do you know in the olden days when there were no clocks to tell the time people would look at the position of their shadow to find out the time of the day transparent translucent and opaque material materials that allow light to pass through them completely are called transparent materials examples of transparent materials are clear glass clear water and clear plastic sheet materials that allow light to pass through them partially not completely are called translucent materials examples of translucent lucent materials are butter paper frosted glass and colored glass clear water transparent materials that block light or do not allow light to pass through they are called opaque materials examples of opaque materials are wood bag book bag opaque book opaque frosted glass translucent activity 1 aim to find out if light can pass through transparent translucent and opaque materials materials required a sheet of clear cellophane paper a sheet of buttered paper and a chart paper method keep a ball on the table now place the cellophane paper in front of it and see if you can see the ball on the other side now try the same with the butter paper and the chart paper what do you see note your observation in the space given below uses of transparent translucent and opaque materials we use a variety of transparent objects in our daily life for example reading glasses plastic wrap and light bulb bifocal spectacle distance section reading section plastic wrap light bulb some translucent objects we use in our daily life are sunglasses butter paper frosted glass a lamp set etc lamp shade sunglasses and butter paper some opaque object we use in our daily lives are books aluminum foil fabrics etc aluminum foil book fabric shadow look at the picture of the boy do you see a dark region on the ground how is this dark region formed the dark region is called a shadow formation of a shadow how is a shadow formed 
a shadow is formed when light here the sources of light is the sun cannot pass through an object that is the object blocks the path of light since light travels in a straight line and cannot bend its path a shadow is formed what to know overhead means right above our head sometimes shadows are long and sometimes they are short it depends on the position of the sources of light thus in the morning and in the evening when the sun is away from us shadow are long but at noon when the sun is overhead shadow is short find out what is an eclipse and how is it formed come in this shadows in the morning at noon and in the evening let us perform an activity to understand the formation of shadows by translucent and opaque objects activity 2 aim to understand the formation of shadows by transparent translucent and opaque objects method take an empty mineral water bottle a steel tumbler and a frosted glass dim the light in the room hold the objects in front of the screen and flash the torch light on the objects one by one write down your observation comment this from the above activity it is clear that opaque and translucent objects from shadows whereas transparent objects do not form shadows can you guess why thus a shadow is a dark region formed by a translucent or an opaque object when it blocks the path of light three things are required for a shadow to form a light source a translucent or an opaque object and a screen a surface on which the shadow can form keywords natural sources of light means objects like the sun and the stars that give light to us artificial sources of light means man made sources of light like torch and lantern luminous objects means objects that give out light non luminous objects means objects that do not give out light transparent objects that allowed light to pass through them completely translucent objects that allow light to pass through them partially opaque means objects that do not allow light to pass through them in a nut cell sources of light can be natural or artificial the sun is a natural source of light objects that give out light are called luminous objects objects that do not give out light are called non luminous objects transparent objects like clear glass and clear water allow light to pass through them completely translucent object like butter paper frosted glass allow light to pass through them partially opaque objects like book and bag do not allow light to pass through them 
a shadow is formed when light cannot pass through an object. A shadow is always formed on the side that is opposite to the sources of light. The size of shadow depends on the position of sources of light. Transparent objects do not form shadow. Translucent and opaque objects form shadows. Mind map Sources of lights Natural and artificial Natural are sun, stars Artificial are bulbs, candles Types of objects Based on emitting light Based on passage of light through them based on emitting light lemunas non lemunas lemunas are bulb candle non lemunas are book desk based on passage of light through them transparent translucent opaque transparent means reading glasses plastic wrap Translucent means lampshade sunglasses, opaque means book, aluminium foil. Exercise Choose the correct answer for each of the following. Do this and comment this. Fill in the blanks. Do this and comment this. Name the following. Do this and comment this. A to transparent objects B to translucent objects C to opaque objects T to luminous objects E to non-luminous objects 4. Answer the following question in brief A. Where are the two sources of light? Give example. Comment this. B. How is a shadow formed? Comment this. C. During which time is our shadow the shortest? Comment this. D. What is the difference between transparent and translucent objects? Comment this. Answer the following questions in detail. Write down the properties of light. B. Draw the explain how a shadow is formed. C. Why do only translucent and opaque objects form a shadow? Comment this. Think and answer. Horse. When we sit under a tree, we find that the shadow of the tree is moving and we have to change our position to be in the shaded area. Why do you think we have to do this? Comment this. Funny activity. Make your own shadow puppet Turn on a torch in a dark room. Now use your hands to make the following shadow. Puppets of various animals on the room wall. Do this. Project. Make your own translucent tracing paper. Take a sheet of a four size paper. Put two or three drops of oil. Spread it evenly across the sheet. Your translucent paper is ready for use. Glass painting. You will need glass painting paint, a see-through acrylic sheet and a colored picture. Procedure. Put the colored picture under the acrylic sheet. Now with a paint brush, First copy the outline of the picture and then fill in the paint. When the paint dries, hold the acrylic sheet against the light and admire your handy work. Life skill. Permit for grades to switch off the lights and fans in his room when he leaves for school. His mother scolds him for that. Do you think the mother does the right thing? Comment this. Across the boundary, imagine the sun got very tired of rising in the morning and setting in the evening every day. So, 
he decides to go on a holiday form groups and discuss what will happen after that share your story with your friends worksheet sort out the pictures and put them under the correct boxes window pane frosted bulb tree spectacles frosted glass mineral water bottle photo frame glass coffee percolator stained glass door lamp shade china vase metal bowl transparent translucent opaque do this and comment this draw the position of the sources of light do this take the correct shadows do this and comment this